Thank you. Good evening, everybody. It's uh, January 19, 2017, the Zoning Board of Appeals meeting. We do not have a forum. We only have two members. And we have our um, associate from the planning board here. Liaison. Liaison. Right. Um, but as we're here, you guys all made it out to be here, we would um, informally maybe take uh, take up or answer some questions if we might be helpful, but this is there's no official business being transaction and nothing. Well, the decision was already. I'm just, yeah. but we're not voting on. Right, there's no voting that needs to take place. Right, so right. any action that happened or any discussion <coughs> that happens tonight would have to be remade in front of a full three-person panel in order to be acted. So do we have a, an order of, is everybody here for um, one thing? Or? We just have um, George Cloris to Northern Boulevard. Mana? Okay. Good evening. Good evening, Mana. Good evening, George. So what we had hoped to do tonight, if you had had a quorum, um, would have been to try to get a written decision out of the board. Um, you all did vote, um, but your vote did not really constitute a decision until the decision is you know, put into a document. Uh, it's not a final decision unless it can be appealed. And once it's you know, written and the 20 day period is, starts to run, that's when it can be appealed, that's when it's a final decision. So um, we're, we want to work with the board. I've already discussed what the next steps are, I think, with uh, Sam and uh, Doug. Um, and George has been in the board many times more than I have uh, discussing it with you all. Well, what they're running up against now is that they need bank financing to get any farther, and they can't get bank financing without showing that they have a permit. Um, so what we were hoping to do was to get a written decision uh, that would um, be able to be issued uh, as soon as you can, um, uh, with the understanding that there are still some open issues. Uh, and that's why I, I, I emailed you uh, some Yeah, drafts. I should. Do you all have copies of the? I read it all, but no, I don't, I don't have it written. Uh, yes, I would. Thank you. I so I had a chance to see it. So. I emailed um, a draft. Uh, <coughs> And so those were my understanding. You know, I tried to incorporate into these uh, draft conditions um, a mechanism to ensure that the items that you wanted done would be completed and that there would be a gatekeeping mechanism, which would be the issuance of the building permit. So you basically issue a written decision conditioned upon uh, George closing out the order of conditions for. Uh, the four spots that are identified on the plan uh, and getting a certificate of compliance, compliance for that and uh, getting an order of conditions to clear the gravel driveway area and the loading area. Um, and then once those were obtained, he'd be able to get his uh, building permit. That was uh, what, what our intent was in coming in here tonight. <coughs> so that's, that's clearly explained. And I guess we were looking, talking for myself now, um, looking for a plan to prove out these two points. Um, and now we're, we're moving those two points from a plan to, to verbiage in terms of the condition. And it's, it's Sam's, I guess, responsibility anyway to make sure that what is agreed to here and documented is acted on. Well, it says that the, the bylaw says that he shall not issue a building permit until the conditions are satisfied. Okay. Um, so I, I referenced the plan in the decision, mm -hmm. um, and so it's clear that you know they'll be working to get the certificate of compliance for these spaces and also to uh, clear uh, this area mm -hmm. uh, for the order of conditions. Sure, there's nothing left to do on those four parking spots. You've cleaned them off, they're clear. Um, uh, the top part, I can clean a little bit. One, one second. Uh, yeah, one second. That's my knee. Uh, that's the neighbor. Uh, 
I, well, not, I don't think David. Yeah, sure. Yeah. Does he want something from you, or does he want something want, from me? You want me to see for you. You want me to see no. something? Yes. Okay. Permission to approach the big table. <laughs> Here, are six copies of the. Oh, is it the easement? This is the one for you guys to have the last. Oh, yeah, okay. Right. So it just shows the area. Yeah. I, so uh, it's, yeah, it's here. It's not swept, and it's, it's. All right. I understand that this yeah. took place. I was more talking about the physical aspect, so that you can get this. Um, yes. Okay. Um, I have not touched. I'm sorry. That's been that's been recorded. You're. you're I have not touched the, the this part yet because I told me not to. You can't. Your your order conditions didn't cover that work, so, so I did not. You're not that. there yet. Yeah. Okay. So, what's the if 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 the order of conditions for the gravel driveway isn't granted or something isn't approved or we don't get a building permit, we can't do our we can't open a restaurant. So do you come back for modifications? You've got financing. You're into the construction work. Building permits going. You're all done. You've got grand opening. It's true. That's a problem. But this is a, a better, um, a better method of getting moving on the project. We're fairly, um, I, won't say, I won't say confident, but we, we think we can get the conditions that we would have taken this. Time. Right, and so that's the only thought in my head is: Are we being, are we putting ourselves in a position and putting you, you're putting you in a position in terms of us granting something that we can't grant or we can't control? And, and it has nothing to do with my benefit. It's your, no, I, your, I, your benefit. I understand your concern. <laughs> I want this to, I want it to succeed sure. as much as possible, and we want to be the first one in line uh, <laughs> for ice cream. I just want to. You know. How about you grant the permit without any conditions? How's that? <laughs> <laughs> Go for it. <laughs> <laughs> Let me get my stamp. Right? Good job. Mark, you come more often. All right. um, no, I don't see any problems. I'm just talking through it. And I guess the only issue then is if, if we have this and you're looking for a timely manner, how do we get three people to hear this and understand this in order for something to happen. How close are you with Millennium Engineering to um, having an application to bring forward? Uh, tomorrow morning would be our first uh, meeting. Our, we've met with them a few times. Okay. Uh, the last email that we had, um, deciding how much it would cost and what he would do to move it, and then based on what happened here tonight, um, I was going to meet with him with uh, the, the guy uh, is it Eric or the other guy there tomorrow and see and then have them come and Eric on the other stuff. Yeah. Now this was um, these four spots here for Mango. It's really it comes down and without that I, I have um, that. So this bag wanted me to have parking for residents. I don't care what I call but residential, I don't care. I bank him on I I need a bank loan. So the, four, so the four oh, so the four you need a you this need a, going on. I know it needs we'll a bank on. loan, but now the bank wants to see that you know we have a permit in place. They also want to see that you know we've got four parking spaces, which we do, um, although we don't have certificate compliance for that just yet. Um, you you may comment that the mm -hmm. bank is concerned for the four parking spots for the residents. Is that is it the residents only that they're worried about? Boys, because isn't it those spots. Yeah. They just want me to have parking. They're like, okay, where's everybody's parking? Yeah. But me. we designated so, that parking for yes, employees and residents. So. Right. We, we, will, we will be able to get the financing as long as we have a decision that's issued. But right now we're in limbo because we have a verbal decision. So we're reopening So in my mind, it opens the box to have to re-advertise. And that's up to you guys to decide, but I mean, the hearing is closed, so. Yeah, but in terms of the understanding of meeting the intent of the parking bylaw, which was the intent of having a plan showing the parking, and the parking is residential, it's employee, and it's loaded. Mm -hmm. And if all that is being provided for in the plan, and the motion and the revision that we are making is really putting the um, 
instead of asking for a plan, we're putting this wordage into the motion that was accepted and, and not asking for a, a plan to be seen and stamped and sign off on. We're, we're stamping verbiage and the checks and balances and controls and the ultimate end is the same thing, whether it's on that plan or decision, in this, decision. Yeah. is if, if we were going back and saying, okay, we, we needed five spaces, I calculated wrong, I read the bylaw, it's different, or you didn't have to do half of that or any of that, that's a much different. This is doing my job. I know. <laughs> and I'm trying to be helpful to a point. Um, if you have a new engineering plan by tomorrow or the next day, isn't that engineering plan, it's going to show the same thing? Or it, it, Yeah. I mean, I don't see why it would. I mean, because there's, there's been no work done. This is just, uh, you know, delen same delineated area. So what happens if this verbiage was put on that drawing as a condition of realizing what's shown on that drawing? Then you submit that drawing, and, and that's the drawing with this verbiage, and that's what we're agreeing to. Well, I was assuming that this plan would be appended to the decision. And then, and then these conditions reference the plan area. I think what he's saying, though, is versus changing the decision. Yeah. If you reference these on the plan, then we've got the plan. Oh, okay. okay. I misunderstood. Is that correct, Eric? Well, I'm, I'm In we're essence. slicing and dicing words here. Right. If we asked for a plan to prove mm -hmm. out what we asked for, if mm -hmm. you give us this plan and it states these, specific conditions of the decision and it's on the plan and then we now approve and stamp and we have that plan and we have your condition we have it all you've given it to us we've, we've got it as much as you've got it and, and so you're trying to uh, let me try to understand um, so would you issue a written decision pending receipt of mm -hmm. that? The, Right, if this was take that, put it on, on here. there with a new revision date. Yep. Okay. Yep. We take the decision, add that date okay. that references this plan. Put it has the, the verbiage decision. on it, and that's what we asked for. But nobody's changed any language of the motion. Um, but we have now a plan that we can all agree on um, because the, the verbiage is added about how those spaces are going to be. So this would be up. something that could be done without waiting until the next meeting. Is that what you're trying to say? Mm -hmm. it, yeah. 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 Yeah, I think so. But, uh, you know, there's two other people. Yep. Um, I'm not, well, I didn't sit on the original folks, so I'm... Uh, that would have to get a copy of it, and then they would have to sign the motion. Uh, Right, motion, right? That's the right word. Um, right, so if you submitted this, this came back to me and I reviewed it and I looked at it and I saw this, I could sign the motion and then I could pass it to the next person and the next person and the motion could come back and the appeal period could start. And yeah, I think we've got the plan that we asked for. It's not exactly clearly shown or says that something has changed in terms of what was previously shown, but this language is the change that makes that loading and that parking happen. Does anybody have any thoughts on that? No, I think you did a pretty good job with it, Eric. Okay. You can post another meeting. Hmm? You can post a meeting next week. Um, you know, well. I'm not trying to shortcut anything, but I think in terms of Need George need getting decision. Mark's representation, understanding that you know we're <coughs> we're being official and in, in what we're doing, and we're not trying to pull over everybody's eyes or let anything go, and we're getting what we asked for. That's that's all I'm asking. That's all I'm trying to make happen. Get it done. And if you want it more official, and you'd like the three people to be here, I don't have a problem with asking for a special meeting next week if we the other two people have the schedule. Well, I, I quite frankly. Um, I thought we had a decision when we first came in, and I had expected a paper decision to be issued, and then George and I didn't communicate for a while, and apparently he was 
continuing to come in and, and, and submit um, material and speak with you. So I, I think you're within your rights to just go ahead and do the decision now because you've already voted. Um, it's just that the decision didn't issue. We need a plan. With the plan. Yes, I got you. No, I, I get you that. Okay. Yeah. So. So it was already voted subject to the plan. Yeah. Yes. Okay. Fine. So we're just yeah. and previous submittals of the plan have been this plan doesn't quite show what it's supposed to say because mm -hmm. that's what we didn't agree to. Now you give us the plan, the verbiage, it conforms to what we had said. I think that's that's exactly what we're doing. Okay. So the decision will not have to be signed as a group. You sign any ritual. It is always signed in the Oh, okay. <laughs> your, we're gonna, your That's language provides yeah. um, yeah. lines on the drawing. We're just going to incorporate this language uh, as a nope. notations uh, sure. that the surveyor was going to put on the in, on the side, uh, and that will be sufficient, um, basically, to comply with the sufficient plan requirement that they have imposed. And change the date. Make sure yeah, it's okay. changed. Okay. Thanks. So I need to contact the board of engineering. I can do it. I would. I can do it. Just put this yep. in a box yep. and put a date on it and get it right there in the corner and make sure it doesn't say that. We're good. And the bank will call and we'll send this post box. I think it's You'll be able to show the bank the plan. You know, you know, they can finish it. Right. That's fine. That's what's going on. Cool. Good. Do you need money to do this? <laughs> <laughs> well, I don't have any luck. I can tell you that. That is true. So I didn't have to go that long. Thank you very much. Thank, thank you for coming in. Thank you. 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 Uh, I move to close the house papers with okay. the I, 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 I